America is facing a serious health crisis, its obesity. A recent CDC report reveals a worrying trend. Obesity rates are climbing across the nation. This isn't just about appearances. Obesity leads to serious health problems. We're talking about heart disease, diabetes, and some cancers. We need to act now. Our nation's health is at stake. These statistics should be a wake-up call. We need to understand why obesity rates are increasing. We need to find effective solutions. This is a critical issue that needs our immediate attention. The CDC report provides a stark picture of the obesity epidemic in the United States. It shows obesity rates on a state-by-state -state level, revealing significant disparities across the country. Some states are hit harder than others, with certain regions experiencing particularly high rates of obesity. West Virginia leads the nation with a staggering 42.8% adult obesity rate, making it the state with the highest prevalence of obesity. Mississippi follows closely behind at 42.3%, indicating a severe public health issue in the region. Arkansas and Louisiana are also struggling with rates exceeding 40 percent. These numbers are alarming and call for immediate action. They point to a growing health crisis that affects millions of Americans. The report doesn't just list numbers, it delves deeper into the underlying causes and contributing factors. It analyzes trends over time, providing a comprehensive overview of how obesity rates have evolved. The data shows a steady increase in obesity rates over the past decade, highlighting a troubling trend. This highlights the urgency of the situation and the need for immediate intervention. We need to understand the factors driving this epidemic, such as poor diet, lack of physical activity, and the prevalence of processed foods. We need to develop effective interventions, including community fitness programs, better nutritional education, and government health initiatives to combat this growing problem. By promoting healthier lifestyles and making nutritious food more accessible, we can work towards reducing obesity rates and improving public health. Continued research and public health campaigns are essential in understanding and addressing the obesity epidemic. Success stories of weight loss and healthier living can serve as inspiration for others. Community involvement and support are crucial in creating a healthier future for all. Together, we can make a difference. The CDC data reveals a concerning pattern. The Midwest and South have the highest obesity rates in the country. This suggests regional factors may be at play. These could include lifestyle choices, cultural influences, or socioeconomic conditions. Further research is needed to pinpoint the exact causes. Understanding these regional disparities is crucial. It allows us to tailor interventions to specific communities. We can then address the unique challenges faced by each region. This targeted approach is essential for effective obesity prevention and management. Socioeconomic factors play a significant role in the obesity epidemic. People living in poverty often lack access to healthy food options. They may live in food deserts where fresh produce is scarce and fast food is abundant. This makes it challenging to maintain a healthy diet. Furthermore, limited access to health care can exacerbate the problem. People may not receive early diagnosis or treatment for weight-related health conditions. This can lead to more serious health complications down the line. Addressing these socioeconomic disparities is crucial for tackling the root causes of obesity. Section 5. Expert Perspectives Understanding the Multifaceted Nature of Obesity Health experts like Dr. Karen Hacker emphasize the complexity of obesity. They point out that it is a condition influenced by a multitude of factors, making it a challenging issue to tackle. It's not simply a matter of willpower. Many individuals face emotional and psychological struggles that compound the difficulty of losing weight. It's a complex interplay of genetic, environmental, and social factors. Genetics can predispose individuals to obesity, while environmental factors like urban design and food availability play significant roles. Dr. Hacker, director of the National Center for Chronic Disease Prevention and Health Promotion, stresses the need for a comprehensive approach to prevention and treatment. She advocates for policies that address these multifaceted influences. Dr. Ruth Peterson, director of the CDC's Division of Nutrition and Physical Activity, echoes this sentiment. She emphasizes the role of community and policy in shaping health outcomes. She highlights the importance of creating supportive environments. These environments can encourage physical activity and provide access to nutritious foods. 
These environments should make it easier for people to make healthy choices. Access to fresh produce and affordable healthy foods is crucial. This includes access to affordable healthy foods and opportunities for physical activity. Community initiatives, such as public playgrounds and fitness classes, can make a significant difference in promoting healthier lifestyles. Education also plays a vital role. Teaching children about nutrition and healthy habits from a young age can set the foundation for a healthier future. Support systems, including healthcare professionals and community programs, are essential in providing the necessary guidance and encouragement for individuals struggling with obesity. Ongoing research is crucial to understanding the underlying causes of obesity and developing effective interventions. Scientists continue to explore the genetic, biological, and behavioral aspects of this complex condition. Ultimately, addressing obesity requires a collective effort. By working together, communities, healthcare providers, and policymakers can create a supportive environment that fosters healthy living for all. Section 6. The Role of Food Insecurity – A Closer Look at Food Deserts Food deserts are areas where access to affordable, healthy food options is severely limited. These areas are often found in low-income neighborhoods, where residents face numerous challenges in obtaining nutritious food. Food insecurity is a major contributor to obesity, especially in low-income communities. When families struggle to afford groceries, they often turn to cheaper, calorie-dense foods that lack essential nutrients. This can lead to a cycle of poor health outcomes including obesity, diabetes, and heart disease. Food deserts, characterized by a lack of grocery stores and an abundance of fast food restaurants, are prevalent in these areas. The absence of supermarkets means that fresh fruits, vegetables, and other healthy foods are hard to come by. Instead, residents are surrounded by fast food outlets and convenience stores that offer mostly processed and unhealthy options. Residents often rely on processed, calorie-dense foods that are cheaper and more readily available. These foods are high in sugar, fat, and salt, contributing to various health issues. The convenience and low cost of these items make them an attractive option for families on tight budgets. This lack of access to nutritious food options makes it incredibly challenging for individuals and families to maintain a balanced diet. Fresh produce and whole foods are often more expensive and harder to find, forcing many to make difficult choices about their meals. The cycle of food insecurity and obesity can be difficult to break without addressing the root causes, including poverty, lack of transportation, and limited access to healthy food retailers. Community initiatives, such as urban gardens and food co-ops, are essential in providing healthier options and educating residents about nutrition. By tackling these issues head-on, we can work towards creating healthier, more equitable communities for all. Section 7, Physical Inactivity, a Contributing Factor to Weight Gain Our increasingly sedentary lifestyles also contribute to the obesity epidemic. Many jobs require prolonged sitting and leisure activities often involve screens. This lack of physical activity coupled with high-calorie diets creates an imbalance that leads to weight gain. Promoting physical activity is crucial for combating obesity. This includes encouraging regular exercise, making public spaces more conducive to physical activity, and promoting active transportation options like walking and cycling. Section 8. Combating Obesity – A Multi-Pronged Approach Addressing the obesity epidemic requires a multi-pronged approach. There is no single solution. It demands a collective effort from individuals, communities, and policymakers. We need to create environments that support healthy lifestyles. This includes promoting access to affordable, nutritious food, encouraging physical activity, and providing education on healthy habits. We also need to address the socioeconomic factors that contribute to obesity, such as poverty and food insecurity. Section 9. Building Healthier Communities – Promoting Healthy Lifestyles Building healthier communities is essential in the fight against obesity. This involves creating spaces that encourage physical activity, such as parks, walking trails, and recreation centers. It also means supporting access to affordable, healthy food options through farmers markets, community gardens, and healthy corner store initiatives. Furthermore, community-based programs that promote healthy cooking, nutrition education, and physical activity can empower individuals and families to make sustainable lifestyle changes. Section 10. 
The Importance of Early Intervention, Securing a Healthier Future Early intervention is crucial for preventing obesity and its associated health risks. This starts with promoting healthy habits in childhood. Schools play a vital role in providing nutrition education, encouraging physical activity, and offering healthy meal options. Parents also play a critical role in shaping their children's dietary and exercise habits. By making healthy choices as a family, parents can instill lifelong healthy habits in their children. Section 11, A Call to Action, Our Shared Responsibility in Fighting Obesity. The obesity epidemic is a complex challenge that demands our immediate attention. It's not just about individual choices. It's about creating a society that supports healthy lifestyles. We all have a role to play. Governments, healthcare providers, communities, and individuals must work together. We need to promote healthy eating, increase physical activity, and address socioeconomic disparities. By working together, we can create a healthier future for all.